Hey, hey, welcome everybody. You know who we got on here today? We've got the, the gentlemen that are killing it out here in Florida. You might Boom. recognize these gentlemen taking over the whole United States now. They're even in my backyard. They're working in Texas. And uh, they have something amazing that they're launching. I think anybody can benefit from this. I'm actually going to join forces with them, and I'm going to join their mastermind. But, yeah, I'll just let them tell you about it. But, uh, yeah, welcome, gentlemen. We've got DeAndre, the man, the myth, myth the legend, and uh, Jeffrey Altador. What's up, guys? Uh, what's going on, and What's going on, Daniel? Thank you for having us. Hey, what's going and, on, guys? What's going on? I knew you guys were up to something big because I were awfully quiet for a minute. <laughs> so tell us what you guys got going on man what, what's new and uh let's, let's get right into it you know what do you what are you guys working on right now yeah jeff you can start yeah anthony so right now um we've actually launched our first wholesaling land community um it's kind of like a course slash community um where we're showing everybody our technique um, that we've been able to use and um, make a lot of money off of, you know, um, and wholesaling land has honestly changed our lives, me and DeAndre. Um, and, you know, we, we just want to give back to everybody out there that's been hitting us up, you know, asking us, hey, you know, when are you guys going to, you know, drop a group? And, and, and here it is. Right. The group is here now. Um, and we're showing everybody um, our technique on how to, you know, make minimum up to five to 10 K a month. Right. Um, but you know, with wholesaling land, there's, there's no, there's no, there's no cap to how much you can make. You know what I mean? It's, it's definitely all up to you. Um, but you know, we, we've been able to create this group and, and really just come out here and provide value to everybody, you know, cause I feel like everybody should know what wholesaling land is. Right. Um, especially to everybody out there that's looking to get into real estate, you know, um, there's a lot of people out there, you know, following the, the wholesaling tradition, uh, tr well, the traditional wholesaling, which is, you know, I guess wholesaling houses, right? Everybody here wholesaling, they say, oh, my God, I, I want to learn how to flip a house. I want to learn how to flip a house. Not knowing that the house that they're looking at, right, that they're driving by, right, they're driving by plenty of vacant land when they're looking at these houses, not knowing that, hey, they're, they're leaving so much money on the table. Um, and that's where we come in, right? Where we, we where we show these guys and everybody else our strategy with, you know, how to find these vacant land and make tons tons of money off of it. Amazing, amazing. man. Yeah. So, what, what's what's your average uh, wholesale fee on these uh, builder lots? So right now, for me, my team has been killing it as of lately. So on these infill lots right now, we're averaging about, I want to say, 7 to 8K um, per, per spread on these lots. Um, nice. And right now, I have, a, I have a team full of six people. Um, I have actually four American callers, and these guys have been killing it. Um, right now, I have over 30 deals in escrow um, with 150K <laughs> loading next month. Um, so Ooh. hopefully all these deals close. Um, and, you know... You know, we're using the best CRM in the business, which is the hive mind, baby. You know, so I, I we wouldn't have been able to close this much deals and lock up this much deals without the hive. So, you know, kudos to Anthony and Daniel for for creating this platform, creating this CRM, this beast where we've been able to pump out so much leads and make a ton of money off of. So, you know, it, it wouldn't, it, you know, the like I said, guys, the deals wouldn't have been made without you guys so man i 100 appreciate you guys for say congrats time. to you guys man that is crazy 30 deals in escrow you know what I, I'll, I'll tell you right now i think everybody knows it i I've, I've never had 30 deals in escrow that's freaking insane <laughs> wow. absolutely freaking killing it dude that's yeah. amazing yeah. Yeah, and it's actually prop. It's actually my highest month right now. Um, last month I came off another six figure month, but this month is at, oh well. Next month is actually going to be probably my the most the most I've ever made in a month um, off vacant land. So I'm, I'm pretty, <laughs> you know. And the team is the team is still growing, guys. You know, I'm I'm still looking for other people out there that wants to join the journey with me, um, and be a part of something special. But you know, right now. You know, I'm just I'm just staying down and staying true to the grind and continue to keep building. Boom. So six figure months, man. That's amazing. That's another one we get to add to the list. I mean, we're, <laughs> we're gonna double digits soon, man. That's crazy. Uh, congratulations, though. So let's 
let, let's let's answer some questions about like what is what qualifies an info lot because a lot of people they think like what what like is it like half acre or less than an acre to five acres or like what what's what's the parameters of what what is the info lot what what makes sense of that? Well, generally generally speaking, um, we go for the the info lots, which is um vacant land that's already sorry about that vacant land that's already within the subdivision. So, um, you know, you may see a house and then you see another house and then you'll see a vacant lot. So that's basically what info lot is. A piece of land that's in a subdivision, you know, it's you know, it's the same size as every other uh, property that's there, um, and it's a bit it's buildable, you know. So, um, and generally, they it, it can range because in different areas, like when you get closer, to, well, I'm, I'm speaking for South Florida, when you get closer to downtown, you know, infill lot can be three thousand square feet. You could build a house, a duplex on a three thousand square foot lot, very tiny. Um, and then in some areas, you need at least 10,000 square feet or 7,500 square feet to build. Um, so an infill lot can be, it can start from 3,500 square feet all the way up to an acre. Some lot, some infill lots, they start, they start at an acre, you yeah. know? So it all really depends on the community or the area you decide to wholesale or find a vacant land in. It's like, hey, is it, this, this is considered an infill lot in this city, but over here it's considered acre. So it depends on the area, but if you find a piece of land that's in the subdivision with properties already, that's a infill lot. Yeah, and believe it or not, guys, my actual first wholesale land deal was actually a three, I'm sorry, a 3,500 square foot lot in Miami where I had it on the contract for 40K and I was able to assign it for 45. And I could have made 55, but since it was my first deal, you know, I was trying to like, see if this was real, you know, see if it was true. But, you know, I was able to make 5K off a of 3,500 square foot lot. It was a little piece of lot, dude. It was just like, whoa, I couldn't believe it. And it was like, wow, I can't believe people are buying this dirt for this much money. And that's when <laughs> everything just everything just clicked. Everything just clicked and it made sense. And it was just like, yo, land is the way to go. So I don't know if you guys talk about it. I could, could, sorry. So, so I don't know if you guys know, my first deal was actually infill lot in Florida that I've never seen to this day. I made six grand on it. So infill lot. Same, here. Same here, Daniel. And you know what's crazy? I probably live, I probably live 30, 35 minutes away from that property I flipped, and I've never drove over there. <laughs> <laughs> we guys, we do everything completely virtual. It's completely virtual. You know, me and DeAndre, we're not getting in our cars, you know, with the gas prices now at six dollars a gallon. No, we're not doing that guys. <laughs> Right. We're doing virtual. Right. Everything is virtual, whether we have to drive for dollars virtually or whether, you know, we, we like to pull a list. Right. But, you know, we, so, we don't we don't need the comfort of our home when doing these deals. So, so you're telling me in Biden's economy, you're doing deals virtually. Oh, yeah. Yes. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. man. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's something that I wanted to touch on real quick because I, I know a lot of people that are either already in wholesaling or looking at wholesaling. But it's like what you said, man, is that you're driving to go look at this house, right? You got to look in there. You got to look in the dirty house and the fleas and the, the roofs falling in. You know, you don't know if it's structurally sound, right? There's people living in it, right? And squatters. And uh, this stuff, we don't even have to look at it, right? No, so we don't. <laughs> that's amazing, yeah. man. That's crazy. Um, so I know you guys are working in the Florida market. But now you're taking on students and mentees from all over the country, right? So tell us a little bit about the mastermind. So um, just just I'll start and then I'll let Jeff go. So just a little bit about the you can call it like all the above. It's like a mastermind slash uh, um, community group, support group, a course. Uh, you can kind of put all of it together. But in this group, we're basically just we're just teaching the niche. We're showing others how to wholesale vacant land and showing them how to flip infill lots for quick for quick cash five to ten k or maybe more um we like i said like jeff said we've been doing it for a while so we're what we want to share this information um with everybody and because it could be beneficial you know there are a lot of people out there that they want to learn this information like everybody has a course to sell everybody has a course everybody has something to sell but it's like hey um what can we come out with that can be affordable for everybody where everyone can do it and then um it's your results are going to reflect directly on your action. It's like, okay. And by the way, it's only one forty nine ninety nine a month. So $150 a month. Right. Um, which is very affordable, very cheap. I think it's too cheap, you know, yes. um, but we had to think about the majority of people and the help that they need, because like Jeff said, um, 
I received, I, I can apply with him. Like I've had, I received several DMs, Instagram, Facebook, people texting me like, Hey, when are you going to start a group? Need some help. Or they'll just flood my, um, they'll just flood my DMs with questions like, uh, real estate questions. Host, Hey, can, how can I get into land? Do you have a course? Um, do you have a group? Like it was just the same questions over and over again. So, you know, it was Jeff idea. So uh, I was like, you know what, let's do it. I came along with him and we decided to do the group together. Um, but yeah, so it's it's all the above community mastermind course um, where they're going to be learning the strategy. Yeah, and the thing about these groups compared to others, we hold our students accountable, right? Um, and you know, we want to make sure that the students that is in our group, right, they're watching the videos that we're dropping in the group, right? We're making sure that they're looking at all the resourceful links that we're we're giving them, right? Because at the end of the day, like the Andre said, right, you you and you you know. Anybody can get the information from us, but it's all about taking action at the end of the day. You know what I mean? And um, and the reason why I love wholesaling land so much compared to these houses, right, is because, you know, when I first got into the house game, um, you know, it, it was pretty tough for me, guys. I, I'm going to be honest. It, I, I never closed a house deal to this day. Um, and it took me about four to five months to actually get my first deal, which was a land deal. But man, when I was in a house game, man, it, it was just so cutthroat, right? <laughs> and 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 you're dealing with sharks out here, guys, right? You're dealing with guys that's spending 70 to 100 k in marketing to go after these houses, right? So when you're going after these houses, I'm like the 20th person to like knock on this dude's door, like, hey, do you want to sell to me? But it's like, you know, they're already under contract. It's too late, right? As far as to wholesaling infill lots. I'm probably like the first or second person to these guys, right? And if I make a good enough offer, you know, it's right then, right then and there, sign, seal, deal, um, which I love info lots because to me, it's just a lot more easier than houses, man. It's it's a lot more easier. So yeah, let's cover uh, reverse wholesaling, which is your whole strategy. How does that work, and how do you how do you how do you uh, make good deals all the time? Because this is genius. Because you guys are geniuses, yeah. Can you guys cover reverse wholesaling? <laughs> yeah, so that's that's basically what it's called. It's called reverse wholesaling. Um, so we basically get in contact with the buyers, agents, or whatever who, whoever's going to be dispositioning a deal. We always get in contact with them first because we want to get in contact with their resources. We want to know how much they're paying. We want to know where they're buying. Once we get that information, now we got enough ammo, and we go out and then we look for the vacant land. That way, we're not shooting blindly. It's like. Um, it makes things quicker, faster, um, and you have some sense of direction because if you're marketing in places where, especially with land, you're, you're marketing in places where you have no buyer, there's no activity going on, um, you're not going to sell it. It's going to sit. Um, you're going to be struggling and you're going to be like, I can't find a buyer. And then you're going to let down the seller. But when you already have a buyer lined up, right, and then you go after these vacant lots, you get it to the buyer right away, Um we don't really need to market it on Facebook. We don't need to send out. When I was, I did once upon uh, once upon a time do houses. I was sending out these large thousand email blasts like all the time. Um, hey, who wants this house? Right with land, I don't have to do that. I got like two or three building companies that I work with in a certain area. I send it to those three guys. I take the ones with the best offer. Um, I don't have to do much marketing for it. One email, and then I get an offer on it. So. Um, I think reverse wholesaling is better, even if even with houses, like if you're going at the houses, I will find the buyers first. Say, hey, where are you looking for houses? What year built? Um, what kind of how many bed and baths do you want to tenant or not? I would start the opposite and then work my way up front. That way you have this buyer already and you're not just looking for buyers on Facebook or social media or something like that. So the um, the reverse wholesale method is like the best way to go. Yeah. And just to piggyback off DeAndre, right? Sometimes it can be very, very tedious when looking for a buyer when you have already a contract um, with the seller. Because, you know, and I'm going to be honest, you know, when I first started off doing this, um, you know, I didn't have a buyer intact. But when I first got my first deal, I was scrambling around looking for uh, the, the buyer that was going to uh, buy my property, I was scrambling for like two weeks because, you know, I had this lot under contract and I had to make sure that, you know, I fulfilled this contract. So, you know, just looking around, looking around. And then I noticed that there was a realtor that um, actually purchased a lot down the same block. I got in contact with her. And then as soon as I got in contact with her, 
Um, I sold her that first property that I had. And then from there, she gave me a list of her criteria of what she wanted, um, how much she was paying, what areas was she was buying in. And then from there, you know, I was able to bring her 10 more deals after that. You know what I mean? And and just from there, she kickstarted my whole business. That one person that I connected with kickstarted my whole wholesaling land business. That's crazy. Yeah, so that's how I'm really like about your, I'm sorry, Dan. That's ahead, something that I really like about your business model, man. And ever since I first met you guys, when you told me what you were doing, like that's freaking genius. Because even me to this day, right, we get a ranch, we blast it out, uh, hit some agents, and uh, the properties get sold, right? So we, we can't keep them in stock, right? We're going to have no inventory. Uh, as soon as we blast them out, they're sold. But with you guys, the way that you do it, it's like your buyer's ready to buy 5, 10, 20 properties sometimes. Mm -hmm. so, that's crazy, man. So you don't have to connect with that many buyers. And so now you're like, this is go get the lots and fill up this gentleman's, you know, account and then he just wire your money done. Yeah. And I, and I kid you not guys, right. I, had, I just got off the phone with one of my, um, my buyers that I actually do business with now. And these guys personally told me that, Hey, Hey Jeff. Yeah. We know the recession's coming, but we don't care. We still need a thousand lots by the end of this year. <laughs> so it's like, <laughs> He told me this personally today, and I'm just like, whoa, I, I need help. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, hey, wherever I can find them, you know, I just want to make sure that I'm always there to provide value to, to, to these guys, to these building companies or to these retail buyers, you know, because at the end of the day, you know, we, we go after the people that has money in their pocket and that's ready to go. Hey, right. hey, hey, Anthony, you um, you gave me a word, man. You, you said pre-sale. And I'm like, well, it is pre-sale because... um. Yeah. What I like about the strategy is that the lots are sold before they even go on the contract. It's like I like I really do like pre-selling these lots. It's like it's like it's like drop shipping. It's like hey, you already got your customer right. They paid you. It's like now you got to go get the order. It's kind of like that. You already got the buyer and the seller. You know, it's it's good to go. So it's kind of like what it is. Um, I really love pre-selling the lots because I'm not going to be questioning who my buyer is. Like I'm telling you, I kid you guys not. Like 30 minutes ago, um. Buyer said I can pay two hundred and sixty-five thousand for this vacant lot. Speaking with the seller, now I have now I, I know my numbers. I have leverage, right? So mm -hmm. we start we're starting at one ninety on the offer, and then now we got enough room to negotiate. You know, um, so that's why I like pre-sale versus if I went if I talk to the seller first, um, I may not know what the offer. Or I may say something too high. You know, so uh, the pre-sale way is the best best way. Yeah, Anthony, that's the best way, honestly. Man, so I, I, just, I just want to back it up real quick, Daniel. So if, if anybody if anybody does is not in real estate, right? And I hope that there is people here that are watching that are on the fence and are wondering, like, should I get into real estate? What are these guys talking about? Mm -hmm. Who are these guys? Um, if once so, what we're doing is we're finding properties, right, at a discounted price by doing marketing, re, out, cold outreach to people that own properties. You take a property, you get it under contract, and if you're if either you can buy it yourself or you can essentially assign or sell the contract right to an end buyer yeah. so if, if you don't have an end buyer in place you can get yourself in big trouble right or you can end up with a contract that you can't move let your seller down and it leads to a weird place so what these guys are doing is they are finding the buyers first right such as builders uh, agents or any, anybody like that that's looking to buy a uh, high volume of properties so then all they're doing is going out and then just finding a high volume of properties so it like eliminates half of the work Yep. Right. So it's, it's freaking an absolute genius, man. And I think it's if, if, you, if you're not in real estate already, even if you are and you're looking to convert to something that probably a little bit easier, the way that these guys are doing it is, is really the way that it should be done. Like I said, like, I'm about to sign up for the mastermind right now. But I think we should tweak our model just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. So one, thing, one thing I want to hop in here, too, is that if anybody doesn't know what areas to market, Florida is your market. Right. And what type of properties are your buyers looking for? Because a lot of people like half the battle is knowing where the buyers are. So if you guys already have the buyers, where can people market in Florida to find deals? Because that's how half the battle's already done. If they can work with you guys. I'm, I'm, I mean, almost the entire state, almost the entire state. Um, it really depends. I'm gonna be honest with you. It really depends on the building company um, and how they're moving because um, this a building company may be buying in 10 to 15 different counties in Florida. Um, and then they're like, hey, we just, we're, we're full in this county. We're going to the next county, you know? Um, so I would just highly advise if anybody want to JV with us, they can probably shoot us a DM or email us or get in contact with us and just send whatever deals they have in Florida. Um, and then we can evaluate it. And then if our buyer take it, then we can make money together. But it's always changing, you know, like um, like one of my buddies got an email a day like, hey, you know, like the bill is canceling on one of their lots because um, 
you know, the interest rates went up and now they're just kind of cleaning house, canceling on some of these lots that maybe they're not in that hot of an area. So things are changing as we speak. So um, I might say I might say an area right now. And then that information is obsolete like 10 minutes later, you know. <laughs> Yeah. No, seriously. He's not lying, guys. He's not lying. I promise you. That's literally how it is. Because, um, you know, these guys are always changing markets, right? Um, and sometimes even with that, right, I'm also, I'm always looking elsewhere as well, right? Um, and even though we're in Florida, um, I'm also looking in North Carolina, Georgia, Texas. I mean, anywhere that has infill lots, right? Because that's our specialty. We specialize in infill lots, right? those little quarter acre lots, half an acre, up to an acre, right? Because, you know, that's 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 quick money for these builders, right? They want something that they can immediately start building on, right? As far as with large acreages, right? Sometimes those deals take three to six months to go through, you know what I mean? Because they have to walk the property. They got to make sure that, you know, Anthony, you know, they got to make sure there's no wetlands on the property, you know, they got, you know, but with these infill lots, it's a lot more quicker, right? Because, it's just an infill, right? It's just a little piece of land. So these builders and these buyers, they probably need about 30 day feasibility study. So after that, you know, we're good to close in 30 days, guys. That's why I love it because it's quick. It's quicker, um, in my opinion. Um, and I love it, man. I, I really do. Yeah, that's crazy. I think what you guys are doing is amazing, man. And I'm glad you, you finally decided to share, you know, uh, like I said, I knew you all were busy. I knew you were up to something. But uh, yeah. yeah, I'm glad you decided to, to do this. I'm actually working on up in my mind a YouTube video that's called Why Everybody Should Be a Guru, right? Because we're pointing fingers and, and, and laughing at the people that are training for a fee, right? But if you're not doing that, it's very selfish to have that information in your brain and not share it with the people around you. And I've known you gentlemen for a very long time, and I know that you have been open to giving away the information, helping people. So I think to put a little paywall between yourself and your audience is probably a great idea because if somebody is asking you of, of, for your time, they should be willing to at least give you some sort of compensation, man. So I love the model. I think what you guys are doing is amazing. I can see this blowing up really, really quickly. And then, uh, yeah, I can't wait to see where it leads, man. Like I said, and I've been telling DeAndre for a year that I wanted to add this to our business model. We just haven't had a chance to yet. <laughs> hey, Anthony, because you're, you're good at what you do, man. Like, you're, you're, yeah. you're killing the, the farm and ranch. It's like, go to Anthony. You want to... You got a property that got some cows and some horses on it? Call Anthony. <laughs> and you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy that you said that, DeAndre? I actually, Anthony, I actually just had a um, 452-acre lot that just fell on my lap today. That's, I think, near Ocala, and I think it's farmland. So I, I was going to go ahead and send that to you after this to see. Oh. Hey, man, I, I, that, that, I've never, ever dealt with anything that humongous in my life so 450 452 acres is foreign to me but to anthony he's just he's just licking his chops like mm, i love it i, want it. I was so, trying to look at there was a couple of months ago i was trying to look at 6600 acres it was like 36 million oh, geez, before i could even get a walkthrough it went under contract <laughs> yeah, I, knew, I knew it was too low that was, that was actually a really low price like, i was i would say that was close to like 50 cents on the dollar at 36 wow. million it's wow crazy. yeah Boy, how do you ride that? That's like a that's like a whole city. Yeah, you're gonna drive it. You gotta you gotta either stay in your truck or you gotta get like one of those little four wheelers. Yeah, you can't walk it. You'll be out. You'll just die. Yeah, like, yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah. You buy a bobcat or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, for the sure. Helicopter's gonna be in the budget very soon. <laughs> yeah, when you, when you go walk properties like that, you have to be armed, like literally, right? Because you never know what you're gonna come across. Yeah. No, seriously. Yeah, it's a lot of yeah. a lot of acres over there. Wow. Yeah, and um, and um, and I forgot to tell you guys, uh, Daniel Anthony, I actually did my I did my first deal in Texas with uh Mr. Saltzman. Boom! Yeah, nice. Exactly. Man. I'm like, hey man, I know I'm doing it in Florida, but can this work? Can this same concept work in Texas? And it works, you know. So um, it works. So me and Dan, me and me and Daniel Saltzman did one deal, and we actually have another one on the contract that we're working on right now. That's kind of like a probate slash not a probate. Um. But yeah, it's, it's awesome. It's awesome. You can really replicate this strategy in multiple states, you know? Yeah, it, it works anywhere, guys. And just like DeAndre said, he closed his deal uh, up in Texas. I, I've actually closed uh, uh, another uh, North Carolina deal um, where I made 17500 and I didn't even need to go there. I didn't, I, I didn't even need to get on a plane and go walk the property, right? All I did was just connect myself with somebody that's buying over there in that area, and I found him a deal just like that, and I was able to make seventeen thousand five hundred in less than 
uh, two months, literally, just like that. 17 um, grand, dude. So we're living in a time right now where people cannot afford gas, getting harder and harder to afford food, yeah. right? And, and so there's people out there that are just, they're struggling, man. I mean, we're, we're, it's probably not going to get any better for a little while, right? Of course, we, if we yeah. get to a recession, it's going to take us probably a year and a half, two years to pull out of it. But you guys are in a business model where you can make, you know, somebody's like three months or six months or a year's pay on a single deal and you don't even have to go see it. Yeah. I mean, yeah, these guys are going to put you on game so that you can uh, get, get a paper contract states away, right. From your laptop or from your cell phone, get it under contract, send it to an end buyer and make yourself a very, very significant amount of money. I mean, you're going to make what somebody's going to make in a year or two years. You, you got, you're going to probably produce that next month. Yep. Right. Yeah. So when I see people saying they're struggling to fill up the tank with gas, I'm like, I wonder why they don't ask me how to, how to fix this problem. Right. Or if they see you guys like, why don't you just talk to us? Like it's going to be yeah. all right. You know, there's, there's no fear in my body at all about any kind of impending recession or anything. So I feel like we're kind of living like in a, in almost like in a parallel dimension. Like we're in a whole different universe. Even if the gas went up to 20 bucks, we're still like, I still put gas in my truck. I still got to go somewhere. Yeah. Right. So I think what we're doing is amazing, man. And I, I do appreciate you guys, like I said, opening it up to the public and getting ready to, to grow a team. So how many guys, how many people do you have in the mastermind right now? Uh, so I, so I checked the count this morning. We're at 64 people. Damn, yeah, you go. Was mind bad. you, mind you guys, we just dropped it last week. <laughs> <laughs> you know, 64 yeah. people in a week. Yeah, yeah and cool. actually we had our first we had our first live on the 15th. So that was actually the first day that we opened it up to actually everybody, which was on the 15th. But, you know, people was hitting us up like before, like booking their spots literally on the spot they're like hey i want to reserve my seat hey i want to reserve my seat and you know they you know over 50 people reserved their seat before we even opened the group up to the public so it was just like whoa and once we noticed that it was like wow like people really really need this knowledge you know yeah and, and i was oh and and i was kind of telling jeff i was like man i didn't know that this many people need help um i knew they i knew people needed help because they're in my dm but I didn't know how many people needed help all at once. I'm like, wow, like it filled up pretty fast. Um, and I really like the feedback we got when we did our call last week. I mean, not well, this week on the um on the 15th, two days ago, you know, people was like, Man, we love the platform, we love the information. You guys set this up so like awesome, it's user-friendly. Um, so we're you know, it's like um, it's like I told Jeff, like the market is spoken, you know, like the market is gonna whatever however you feel in business, whatever you're selling, whatever you're doing the market is going to speak to you one way or another. The market is going to tell you whether you should do something or not. Um, and honestly, with the amount of people we have and the positive feedback, the market has spoken, you know? So I'm um, really happy about that. And I'm happy that the um, the people that join are also happy because uh, I'm always asking for feedback. Like I'm writing people, hey, what do you think about the platform? Hey, what do you think about the videos? Anything we should change? Hey, anything we should add? Like people are like, yo, it's awesome. I'm going through it. They'll let me know. So, so far, so good, man. You know, it's awesome. So yeah. where can people sign up? Because I know well, we'll probably play this again in a, in a couple weeks or so. So we'll probably link it all over there. But just message you online to get the link to join that. Yeah, the um, if you if you can go to um, Flipping Contracts Dre on uh, Instagram or Jeffrey Outdoor, um, the link is going to be in our bio, and you'll be able to click that, and then you're going to hit a paywall. Put in your information, your information, and then you'll be in the group right away. Um, I do recommend when you join the group, make sure you put a uh, bio, something about yourself, because everybody that's in the group, I don't care if it grew to 300 people, I want to get to know you as a person, as an individual. Yeah. I want to know where you're from. I want to know what you do. And I want to know what what's what got you into real estate or why are you doing it? Because everybody has a why, what, why they're doing it. So uh, make a bio, DM me, make a post, whatever, you know. Um, so I can get to know you better as a person. Yeah. There you go. There you go, man. Um, I'm gonna, so I'm going to drop that uh, that Instagram handle inside the chat right now in the comments. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because I just seen somebody ask, is the mastermind still open? Um, but yes, it is. It's open now to the public. You know, we we want to definitely touch and help as much people as we can with this niche that we, you know, we've been killing. Um, but. Man, man, it's, it's honestly truly a blessing to, to just even have this knowledge and to be able to spread it out to everybody and, and and change people's lives. You know what I mean? Just like Anthony said, during these tough times, recession, you know, people are even worried about people are just worried about gas, how they're going to, you know, find their next meal. You know, everything is just sky high right now. But 
you know, with, with our niche that we're doing, you know, as long as you take action, man, you know, you don't ever have to worry about gas. You don't ever have to worry about, you know, finding your next meal because, you know, the, the stuff that we're teaching, man, all you have to do is take action, right? Because, you know, there's a lot of people out there that just love to just, you know, join a course, watch videos, but sometimes they get they get scared to just pick up that phone and or make that first dial. But with us, you know, we make sure that you're not scared. We make sure that you're picking up that first call and dialing and calling your first seller, right? Because at the end of the day, you want to get over that hump of just fear of failure, right? And that's what, you know, that's what we try to get out of our students, right? Just to get rid of that fear, right? Because, you know, the only thing that's stopping you at the finish line is, is, is just picking up that phone call, right? Picking up that phone and dial at the end of the day, right? Um, and, you know, in, that, in our group, you know, we hold everybody accountable. We, and, and, and the goal for us, right, is to make sure everybody in that group at least closes a deal, right? That's what we want because we want people to believe that this works, yeah. right? I know a lot of people out there that are thinking, oh, my God, this is fast money. Look what DeAndre and Jeff are doing. They're making tons of money, but they don't know the work that was behind it, right? They don't know the sweat, the blood, sweat, and tears that was behind it, right? Yeah. So in our group, that's what we we, we try to – we try to preach to them, like, you know, especially mindset wise that, hey, man, real estate is a grind. It's slow. Right. And we're not only showing everybody how to just make 5K, 10K, 15K. We, that's easy. Right. We're showing guys how to build a business through this. Right. And that's why it's called the land flipping empire, because it's bigger than us. Right. You're creating an empire for your family, your, your, your loved ones. It's generational. It's deeper than you. Right. So. If you're worried about making five to ten k, you know, hey, you can make that and and, and leave. But hey, we you know, we're looking for other people that's worried about you know creating something bigger than themselves, right? And that's why we created the group, and that's why we named it the Land Flipping Empire because you know we're, we we want to show people how to build an empire from ground zero using hive mind. Using hive mind. Come on, man. <laughs> hive mind. Hey, hundred fifty. Hey, 150k in escrow, all hive mind, all hive mind. Damn, 150 in escrow. Yeah, that is dope, Ooh. man. I like that you make that distinction. Like, this is not a hat trick. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. 5k, 10k. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's not, it's not a, a gimmick. You know what I mean? Like, no. yeah, like you can do this repeated, repeatedly, over and over and over again for the rest of your life until America sells out all the land. <laughs> <laughs> Which I don't think, I don't think it would ever, ever sell out of the land. You know, no, he's just going to keep on growing in every direction, every major city. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. So uh, one thing I really want to segue into is Jeffrey is speaking at our event in August 25th and 26th in Fort Lauderdale. So um, that's where you can meet DeAndre and Jeffrey. Come out live. If you're from Florida, come check us out August 25th and 26th. Tickets you can get at thehiveislive.com slash summit. Thehiveislive.com slash summit. Um, check it out. Like I said, we're going to be able to meet and greet these people live in person and we're going to be out there our family's going to be there we're gonna have a great time out there i'm really excited to meet jeffrey because i don't think i've met jeffrey I haven't had a chance yeah, to meet yeah it's gonna be my first time actually meeting you daniel i can't wait i'm excited hey yeah so, we're already hanging out man over there when i was there the last time we went and hit the jet skis and everything without you bro we yeah i know i was mad about it <laughs> man, those jet skis were fun man it was fun i want to do it again yeah, I, can't it was I can't wait to see you guys man in august so yeah, well, um, you're going to come a little bit early and stay a little bit late, man. So if you guys leave a day or two open for us to hang out again. Oh, yeah, of course. Sure. Anthony, hey, of any, course. Anything for you guys. Of course, man. This is our city. Hey, you're you're in our backyard. So it's going to be our time. It's going to be our turn this time to take you guys and treat you guys, you know, because um, last time you did that for us, Anthony. Now, you know, let me and DeAndre do that. It's going to be our our turn. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, I was just glad you guys had the time to hang out. It was super fun, man. It was dope. Yeah, and, and just, just yeah. so anybody knows that if you don't know these two gentlemen, they're really, really good, genuine guys. Yeah, when you get to know them on a more personal level, I can, I can tell you, yeah, I, I spent time with these gentlemen and went on for a long time, and they have really good hearts, and great souls. I appreciate it, man. So, man, and any final thoughts, man? The Hive is Large Staff Summit .com, Their link is right there. Go check it out. Uh, so we're selling tickets right now. We're almost sold out, so check it out. We appreciate everybody that's coming out. We really want these Florida people to come out. This is, this, this uh, event is for you. For us, we have done our we did our event in Dallas because we had a lot of Dallas, uh, Texas people come out for our first event. Now we're putting it in Florida for all our Florida people. So if you're in Florida, do not miss this opportunity to come hang out with the hive mind. 
Uh, we're all going to be there. This, this, uh, we have a well, lineup of great speakers, including these two gentlemen right here below me. And um, definitely check it out. Check out Hive Mind. Check out everything we do. Uh, any final thoughts for the Mastermind? Any any uh, thing you want to want to mention right here before we end it? Closing um, arguments. I, closing <laughs> arguments. Closing arguments. Like we're in the courtroom. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's, uh, so all I have to say is that. Um, if you're on the fence about it, if you're thinking about joining, uh, maybe whatever you've been, um, maybe whatever you've been doing isn't enough, or maybe you haven't learned what you thought you was gonna learn. Um, just give it a shot. Um, and the reason I tell you that is because there are people in the group um, that said, "Hey, you guys, are, I've learned more from you guys. Paid you guys 150 bucks than I learned from a thousand dollar course." You know, um, and that that and you know, I'm glad someone said that because that happened to me. I paid five grand for a course. Right. Um, when I want to learn real estate, um, it was beneficial, but not as much. I paid um, a guy, Joe McCall, like fifty dollars. And his course took me from zero to get my first deal when I first started. So it's like, yo, I took a fifty dollar course and I learned more than I told, did when I took a five thousand dollar course. Um, so uh, if you're on the fence, um, if you're like, man, do I want to pay, pay for another one? I haven't done no deals yet. I want to get into real estate. But how? Um, just give it a shot. You know, um, I say just give us an opportunity to help you and to change your life. That's all for me. Yeah, man. And just to piggyback off DeAndre, what he said, same thing over here, man. Just give it a shot. You know, don't be afraid to bet on yourself and learn something new. Um, and I can 100 percent guarantee you that, you know, our strategy, our niche that we've been killing it is is very simple. Right. All you have to do is just take action. Right. Um, and, and everything will just fall in your fall in your lap. Right. Um, but, you know, if, if you have any questions or concerns, you know, feel free to DM me on Instagram or Facebook. Um, my, my Instagram is my name here, Jeffrey Altador. Or you can DM DeAndre on Instagram or Facebook. His Instagram is Flipping Contracts, Flipping Contracts Dre. Um, and, you know, shoot us a DM, guys. You know, we don't bite. We, we love to hear every from everybody. You know, we want to. We want to we want to talk to everybody. You know, what, what's what what's stopping you from joining our mastermind? Because, you know, we're, we're here to change your life as well. As long as you're ready to, for change, you know, we're, we're ready to help you and, and get to that next level. Uh, one thing I'll say is uh, me and Anthony, we resonate with this is that we support people that support people. So we're always here to support you guys and whatever you guys are doing. And it, we're always here to support you guys, man. Because you guys are out here making a difference, and we're here to we're here to help contribute in our own way to help make a difference as well. So we're always going to align with people that want to help change the world, and we're here to support that. So thanks, thank you for contributing and making the world a better place by do, doing what you guys do, man. You guys are amazing, and we appreciate you. We, we've uh, we appreciate we appreciate to have the opportunity to help you. Stop, Dan. You're about to make me cry, man. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Let's Bye, go. Man. <laughs> oh man, you guys are awesome. Go ahead, Jimmy. Yeah, I was gonna say that that's pretty much all we have, man. Like I said, if anybody's watching this right now, if you're still on the fence, it's 150 bucks a month. The information like this is hidden behind five and ten and twenty thousand dollar paywalls because I've hit them. I've never pulled the trigger on it, but with <laughs> their, I know for a fact what they're offering you is the same stuff that you would learn in the course that you would drop 10, 20 grand on. So for 150 bucks, get off the fence. And if you're super broke, message me. I'm gonna give you the first 150 bucks. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, you heard it from the man himself. Anthony. <laughs> hey, that's called that's called an infinite return on investment. I'm gonna use Anthony's money to get in the group. I'm gonna make money and then I'm just gonna disappear. <laughs> <laughs> All right, forget about when he gets to the top. <laughs> All right, gentlemen, we appreciate you, man. Yeah, thanks for hanging out. I look forward to seeing you guys again real real soon. Oh, All yeah. right, thank, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Thank you, guys.